Hello everyone! So obviously, by the title of the video, haul, giveaway, fun things. I've been just like putting all the random orders into a box. There was a couple of big orders I did and then Simon was doing some really good sales. So let's just dive into all of the greatness. I'll zoom in a little bit. So I picked up the Altenew Bold Alphabet die. This is the lowercase. I have the uppercase. And then this one was on sale. It was like half price or something, which I was like, oh yes. I love alpha dies, especially big ones. They're so fun to make like banners with and custom sentiments, all that kind of stuff. So I picked up that and they're like, what are these? They're roughly an inch wide by the tall ones are a little over an inch and a half tall. So like a nice size. So I got that and then I got some like random things that had caught my eye. Like this and that. Let's just kind of see here. Okay. <clears throat> so I just got the alcohol ink tools that I already have um, mini mister bottles, but it's always nice to have extra ones. You can't put um, the blending solution into a mister. It's highly recommended you don't, but what you put in is like you can put rubbing alcohol into the mini mister. You can spray it on your alcohol backgrounds and it creates a totally different effect. I thought it would be nice though to have the brushes to do some cool effects. They're completely synthetic brushes. They're softer than I thought they would be. For some reason I thought they would be much stiffer. But it'll be nice just to have these specifically for working with alcohol inks and not use them for anything else. So that's basically why I got it. So I got that. And then I saw this in the store. I didn't even know this existed. This is the alcohol ink blending pen. So dual tipped empty pen to fill with alcohol blending solutions used to blend dry alcohol inks already applied to non-porous surfaces. So <clears throat> this you can put the blending solution in because you're not spraying it anywhere. Um, the reason it's very much recommended that you don't spray the blending solution is because of the resins in it and they're highly flammable. You don't want to get them on anything other than what you're creating. But this is obviously just controlled. So I was thinking this would be great. You fill it with the blending solution and then you can, you know, add little effects and whatnot. You could even draw onto it. So there's the fine tip and it seals up like really well because obviously you don't want to um, this any of this to like dissolve or anything. And then there's a wider tip. So it's cool. I'm going to be playing around with it. Oh, I guess it like pulls out. I'm just trying to see like, how, it's like, how does this work? Okay. Yeah. So I think you just fill it like right there. So that's cool. These, this is going to be fun to play with. So that is this cool alcohol ink blending pen. So I got that. And then I also got, I'd mentioned this in a previous video about the Brutus Monroe stamp cleaner. You can get the refill and you can also get just the spray bottle. So it's squeaky clean. There's a four ounce bottle and then there is a, I think this is a two ounce spray, something like that. So it seems different than the ultra clean. Um, yeah, it seems more like just a basic stamp cleaner, which I like. I like having both. I use my ultra clean for removing a bunch of stains, but ultra clean has that little bit of a residue to it. So I like using ultra clean and then just a regular other baby wipe or something like this to just remove any of that residue and just leave things clean. So we've got those and then again, this was just kind of random. Um, Gina K. This will be very similar to the Lawn Fawn one. This is the Gina K. Tidy Towel and then there's the Lawn Fawn Stamp Chamois. So same idea. I like I like the Gina K one. I like the Lawn Fun one because it's aqua. I like the Gina K one because this one's gray. So because it's sealed, it comes soft, but this will 
harden when it dries and it'll literally be like rock solid when it's dry and then all you have to do is run it under water and it'll move around and get um, damp and soft again just like so. So yeah, really fun, really cool. And then you can just use that to clean your stamps. So really neat. So I just picked up one of those. Okay, speaking of Gina K, I also got this um, You Make Me Smile stamp set. Isn't that not gorgeous? So gorgeous. Just love that. So yeah, for you, hello friend, I love you, you make me smile. And then I also got this one. This is the On My Mind and In My Heart. I like how it's all like on a line, all these flowers. And then yeah, you're on my mind and in my heart. You make me so very happy. You mean the world to me. It's been so pretty. Isn't that pretty? So I got those ones. And then I got this. This is an older waffle flower set that I've just had my eye on for the longest time. And then finally decided to like just get it already because I just think it's the cutest thing. So this is the books and coffee stamp set. So you've got a little coffee mug and a book and then all these little like animals that can be peeking out behind things. I just, I love that. I think that's so cute. So yeah, happiness is a cup of coffee and a good book or you can change it to tea. So isn't that cute? I love like the little bunny like peeking out. Ah! So I also got the coordinating die set as well because especially all these little characters um these two little bunnies it'll cut out the bunny and it'll also cut out right around their little their little paw there so that you can like tuck them onto these or you can you know turn them into little bookmarks anything like that so i really like that sort of stuff i just i think it's just the cutest little set ever cutest set ever so i got that and then i also got this um tonic brown craft cardstock. This is a little bit heavier weight than um, some of their others. This one is 103 pounds. The other stuff is like 80 on average. So this is a little bit heavier weight. I don't know again if I would necessarily use this as a card base, but I like like there's one side. They have two different sides to it. So that's kind of cool. Interesting. So you got kind of options with that. I, I like it. It's just a different sort of texture and very different than like the craft card stocks I have. So yeah, I got a pack of that. And then, oh my goodness, um, I went a little bit crazy, of course, with the doodle bug. Um, doodle bug release. Doodlebug's always releasing new stuff, but they released a couple of amazing collections. And I've got stuff falling everywhere. Let's kind of get some of this out of the way. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, Doodlebug came out with a ton of amazing things. And I, of course, had to own all, I couldn't stop myself. So the first one is the Adorable Sweet Summer Collection. Let me open up this paper pad. So we've got the absolutely fabulous, just, it's so cute. Oh, I love, should've got two packs of this. <laughs> Oh, uh, it's so cute. I love it. Absolutely love it. It is adorable. See so yeah, a little fruit and polka dots and waves and sun and popsicles, and polka dots and just really, really, really cute stuff. I love little drinks and flowers and just, this is definitely like the summeriest of paper packs. Love love and yeah I should have got two of those um and then oh, I, I literally tried to limit myself and then I was like nope I have to I have to have every single thing even the cardstock stickers which I never use I literally hoard the cardstock stickers because I don't know they're just adorable so there's all these ad absolutely adorable cardstock stickers that are all like dimensional you know several layers so there's that one, 
Apple Drinks one. Is that not the cutest thing ever? That one. We've got that. I love, love the boom box and the cassette tapes. Oh, little lemonade stand. Popsicles. Fun little drinks. There's washi tape. There's um, a popsicle washi tape and a cocktail washi tape. So cute. Tons of um, shape sprinkles. So there's the cool treats. Love. Tropical punch. Um, I think the jewels, yeah, the jewels go with the other pack. So, okay. We've got the summer assortment of sprinkles. I just love the colors. We have the fun fruit. Like they all have little happy faces. Ah! And then this adorable Hello assortment. Glitter sprinkles. Oh, the Hello assortment probably goes with the other pack as well. It's hard to remember what goes with what. I think those go with the other collection. Okay. So there's that one. And then I, st I also got, I couldn't resist. There's the Icons sticker sheet. Isn't that fun? It's just so cute. Icons, and then there's the mini icons um, pack. So you have the large one, and then there's the small one, and they're all different. Aren't those just the cutest? Like, seriously. So you got all of that. Let me get all this out of the way. And then there is the fabulous um, odds and ends and chit chat. So the odds and ends, these are all the die cut shapes. There's 80 die cut pieces in these. Like, it's just insane. Completely insane how much you get in one of these packs. And they're all just absolutely adorable. Like, look at that. Oh. Isn't it cute? So cute they're just the most adorable little things ever so yeah really fun so yeah these would be really fun on cards if you are a scrapbooker these would be amazing to make mini albums with and scrapbook i don't scrapbook i just like to hoard all the things like that is the cutest thing ever isn't that adorable like Tons, 80 pieces in one of these packs. So you get all of those. I'm gonna put these all back in, put them all back in the package because I don't want to lose them. So we got that. And then the chit chat ones, same thing. You get a ton. There's 92 in this one. And these are all like speech bubbles and words, like tons of speech bubbles. Hello, happy birthday. And then big ones. So yeah, these obviously would be really awesome for scrapbooking. So yeah, all these ones. And then like banners, sweet memories, a beautiful day, daydreaming. Um, fun in the sun, fun summer, aloha, all that kind of stuff. Like, yeah, I really like the speech bubbles because these are perfect for, you know, cards and whatnot. So life is better with friends you know aren't these oh. yeah again if you're new to my videos then i'm kind of obsessed with doodlebug have been since its inception and i love to collect it and pet it and i do cut into it occasionally <laughs> oh my goodness so okay so that was that one and then there is also um, 12 by 12 here. I just like having the Doodlebug 12 by 12 paper packs and I like to just cut the tops off. Makes it easier to access. So yeah, 12 by 12 assortment in all these great patterns. It still sucks. What the heck? There we go. So, just great polka dots. Tons of polka dots. And a bit of plaid. And some stripes. Like, just really nice. Really nice papers. There's those. 
And then there is the Doodle Bug, where's the 6x6 pack? The Hello Collection, which is absolutely, I just love this color combo. I have a feeling both of these are going to be really popular, but especially this one. This one has foil as well, so you've got just absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous, 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 and then yeah, there's foil in this one. So that just gives it that little extra something. Got little telephones and polka dots. And florals and oh, I really like that. Foil. All little birds, stripes, and little cameras. Ooh, I really like these. Just look at the colors. They're just so nice. This one actually has a little wood grain on it. So yeah, really, really fun collections. There's that. It also has a 12 by 12 petite print assortment. Same idea. Just in colors more to go with that pack. So there's that. The fabulous icon stickers, which again are all foiled. <sighs> Love. So there's the icons, and then there's the mini icons of this one as well. So you have, and they're both. Yeah, the mini icons are foiled as well. They're so pretty. So pretty. You have the mini icons and then the um, odds and ends and chit chat, which are also foiled. So, yeah, this collection, like I said, this collection is going to be popular because it's adorable. This one has 101 die cut pieces and they're just. Ooh, and this one has some clear ones. That's fun. So, yeah, all of these gorgeous, gorgeous foiled. Fabulous, and then some of these are like on like an acetate, but also foiled. Oh, I like so much. Oh. These are just gorgeous, seriously. Oh. Isn't that fabulous? I could just like spread these out. <laughs> it just makes me happy. So yeah, that's really fun. So feathers and flowers and hearts and tons. Tons and tons and tons. So that's the odds and ends pack for this. And then the chit chat will be the same idea. A whole bunch of big words, banners, a ton of speech bubbles, and tons of it is foiled again, which is just awesome. So yeah, foiled, you make me happy, love you bunches, hello friend, friend, sweet, smile, enjoy the ride, lovely, all that foiling is amazing, you're my happy place, lovely, just because, so yeah, home sweet home, let's catch up, it's a beautiful day. Look at all that. Have a nice day. XOXO, I miss you. You are ama you are amazing. So yeah, like enough to keep a person busy forever or enough for someone like me to just pet and hoard and <laughs> oh my goodness. So tons upon tons of those. So that's that one. And then all of the like embellishments, of course, are beyond fabulous. So there's all of these. Again, I couldn't resist the stickers. I, I couldn't help myself. They were just too adorable not to be. So there's this door. And again, foiled. So yeah, there's a cute little house one. And then this gorgeous flower one. Like all the layers to it is just fabulous. And then we've got this globe and an envelope with a little letter coming out, the camera, typewriter. I really like this one too. It's so pretty. And a little phone. Aren't those just adorable? 
There's that, and then um, these great washi tapes. There's the hello, there's hearts, and then the gorgeous flowers. Those are really nice. Really nice. And then all of the enamel stickers. There's the hello ones, which are also foiled. Those are so cute. So we've got the enamel, those ones, and then there's the beautiful blossoms. There's the Hello Assortment and the Hello Assortment Jewels. The jewels, of course, go really well with this collection. And I got two packs of these. I, it's hard, it was hard to tell what they look like online, but yeah, they're the Heart of Gold. And they're just foiled and glossy. And I love that they come in three sizes too. So, yeah. I think that was the entirety of these collections. I think I got every single thing because I couldn't not get them but I'll have links to all of it as always so that was that and then um I said giveaway so that's what this is about so I had shown in a haul video um the ink on three this one's falling apart the ink on three set of three inks and I've been using two of them in videos um I haven't used the fade out no line coloring yet like I've played around with it but I haven't done a video with it yet because I don't do the no line coloring as much but I've heard really good things about it but yeah so I've been using these a lot I've been using the blackout I really like the like these are really great inks so anyway um ink on three contacted me and they'd offered you know a bunch of product that I could order for myself and rather than just you know get myself more stamp sets and different things that I obviously have a ton um, and I obviously don't need more inks because I just got them for myself and I don't need more of them they're gonna last forever um, instead I ordered a bunch of packs of the three pack of ink so I have five packs of these inks to give away to you guys I thought it'd just be a nice fun way to pay it forward so I will have a link to my blog post and in the blog post will be the widget um, that's the easiest way to run giveaways, especially when there's multiple things because I'm gonna have to ship these out to the winners and giveaways can be a lot of work. So I'm just gonna do it that way. So there will be five random winners that will each win a set of these awesome three ink on three inks. So if you're interested in winning that or the links or anything, I will have that in the description box below the video. That'll be the first link will be to my blog post with the giveaway info. And yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Thank you all so much for the support, for commenting, for thumbs upping, for sharing my videos, all that stuff. I appreciate it more than words can say. And I love being able to, you know, do little things to kind of pay it forward and, you know, give people a chance to try something new. So thank you for watching and I will see you all very soon in the next video. Bye.